2016 for you and a guest, but you've got to register for it at am570themission.com. And while you're registering, you can get a free copy of his new book, How to Make Wise Decisions. Straight ahead, turning point. Oh, you want that? I think a lot of people are saying, okay. Sounds good to us. Right. Okay. Uh, my friend emailed me during the show and said, "Don't be so." Выходит в эфир и рассказывает о новостях, и uh, вот именно uh, он и объявит, uh, какой же день. Uh, Rip them right. after the game. Good. I mean, you appreciate a guy who gets it. I'm ripping you through, Steve. <laughs> That'll make you feel warm and fuzzy. He wouldn't expect anything else. Yeah, exactly. But Brandon Marshall said after the game, I. So listen, uh, I love Trump. I'm all for Trump. But he does have to cut back a little bit on the... Because this country is unfairly convicting and imprisoning African-American men. And they make big causes about getting these prisoners released. That all this incarceration is an example of... Well, you know, they'll say things, oh, man, you know, because I know the gangbangers because, you, you know, I'm from the neighborhood. Right. So, I, I, you know, they give me a little grief. I, I, I disagree. You know, like, and then when I... Like... And I... Is this the last day, Brian? No, uh, we're going through Wednesday. But you're Wednesday. But but it's getting down to the holdouts and the, the hardened criminals, right? Or those yeah, who haven't, could, haven't given yet. Put it that way if you want. So, and I, and I just heard this amazing opportunity presented by the Kaplan Fund. So I just... Plenty of sunshine throughout the day today, but on the chilly side with a high of 59 degrees. Clear and chilly again for tonight with the low dropping down to 45 in Midtown. But some of the coldest suburbs getting down to 32 degrees. For tomorrow, we'll see some sunshine early, then giving way to clouds as the high reaches 61 for tomorrow afternoon. Cloudy still on Wednesday with rain developing in the morning and continuing throughout the afternoon, even into the evening as well. Could be heavy at times. Breezy and mild on Wednesday as well with a high of 66 degrees. Currently 50 and sunny in Midtown, reaching a high of 59 today. I'm meteorologist Courtney Spamer in the WCBS Weather Center. WCBS News Time, 1030. Marla Diamond, WCBS News Radio, 880. Of course, we'll have coverage of the marathon coming up Sunday from the starting line to the finish line and even overhead in Chopper 880. We hope you join us on Sunday. Police are looking for four men who attacked the driver of a green taxi in Brooklyn. Police say the men broke both side view mirrors. <laughs> de líquido, usted está eliminando potasio. Ajá. La falta de potasio, no le mandaron a tomar potasio tomando esa medicina. No, doctor. Should have received. She blames the delay on a fraud snafu, so she's proposing the Flood Insurance Transparency and Accountability Act. If passed, FEMA would now be required to let homeowners see all the documents that relate to their claims under the National Flood Insurance Program. Sports tonight, the Islanders host Calgary, view bank online, pay at doc doc com. Traffic is still being diverted off the Southern State Parkway. A word of warning here, if you're heading from Queens to the south shore of Long Island, you want Sunrise Highway, the eastbound Southern State Parkway, shut down at the Meadowbrook Parkway. Everybody diverted there because of an accident just afterwards. There's at least a 45-minute backup into the detour. If you're coming out of the Holland Tunnel into Jersey, ongoing construction under the covered roadway slows down that ramp down to 1 and 9. The ramp to the turnpike, not bad. Leaving Jersey, the Holland Tunnel, not a bad ride. Ten minutes at the Lincoln Tunnel, the George Washington Bridge, 20 minutes to the upper deck, minor delays downstairs. Sunny upper 50s today, now you know how not to go. I'm Tom Moot on AM 970, The Answer. Brought to you by My Clean Peace. Heavy on the Harlem River FDR combination from the 130s to the 70s. Crossing the Hudson, 10 to 15 minutes on 95 Express to the GW Bridge upper level. That'll be the heaviest of the approaches. We're down to about 5 to 10 minutes at the Lincoln Tunnel. Minor delays at the Holland Tunnel. Alternate side parking is in effect. Our next report at 1041 on 1010 Wind. Traffic and transit sponsored by Mercedes. The Daily News reports six men are being charged with firearms offenses after undercover cops caught them selling illegal guns. The paper says the accused were based in East Harlem and will be arraigned before Manhattan Supreme Court Justice Edward McLaughlin. McLaughlin's name...
MyEndlessPower.com and do it now. was exceedingly diseased and he had the strangury and was in great pain but he reasoned the case with himself thus oh lord que bonita manera de contestar digo auditorio del programa Eugenio Lucas buenos días este es reportijo deportivo oiga oigo Mauricio Sulaimán I'm sorry. Um, frankly, I was a little bit shocked that we have no big contract. Can you elaborate on that a little bit? Sure. So, um, you know, um, so this is, um, this is something that I've been uh, arguing against since 2000. <laughs> 